Should someone with AFib that's controlled and taking Eliquis be okay eating quality salmon roe? That's a, a unique question. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so someone who has controlled atrial fibrillation and they're on Eliquis, which is a blood thinner, one of the big problems with AFib is that you can develop a blood clot. So mm -hmm. if you want, you want to be anticoagulated and that's what Eliquis is doing. Um, and so she asked if she can really take, take omega-3. She's talking about salmon roe, okay, but the, fundamentally she's asking, should she take omega-3? And I would say yes, maybe a gram a day, EPA, DHA, 1,500 milligrams maybe would be a very reasonable intake. I don't know um, how much salmon roe she's talking about, but what I would not do if I had AFib is take four grams a day. When you're talking about dietary intake of omega-3s from fish, salmon roe, those doses are much, much, much lower. It's harder to overdo it, doing it through the diet.